Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Final Fantasy VII. In the last episode, we managed to escape from the soldiers, get back on the train, and head back to our headquarters. Um, met our childhood friend Tifa, have her join our party, and now we're about to head back out for our next mission. So, um, before we go though, um, I would suggest probably do some shopping. Um, if you remember the last episode, this place was locked up. But, um, after you rest and everything and get ready for the next mission, um, he'll be open. Um, this dude actually sells some pretty good stuff. He'll sell you some potions, antidotes. Um, he even sells materia. Um, now, since you have most of these materials already, I would recommend buying the fire materia because that's the only one you don't have yet. Um, I've actually already did, kind of did some of my shopping off screen. Um, I already bought my fire materia, gave it to Barrett. Um, but yeah, um, one important thing you want to do though before you go, um, head back into this shop and head to the second floor. Um, and you want to grab this this thing right here. This is important. This is an all materia. Hey, you got one right off. That was materia. Next, take this treasure chest. Open that up, and it'll give an ether. Um. Now, all material is a very important one to have, because basically what that does is let you use area magic, so... In this case, I would prefer having it with the light. I would attach it to the lightning one. Um, talking to these guys is not really important, they just let you learn about um, battle things, but you don't really. I don't really need that. You get a safe spot too. Um, I've already saved, but I'll go ahead and save again, just for, just for this sake. So, yeah. Yeah, so that all material is very important, so make sure... Make sure you grab that before you head out. So, yeah, head back out. Oh, yep, that's another thing. I missed it. Um, yep, head up here, before you leave, go up this ladder, and if it'll let me, there we go. This, in here, this is basically, this is the slums, I don't think you can stay here for free, what are you gonna do? Yep, I'll give him, so yep, give that dude ten bucks, and it's basically your inn, so yeah, you can sleep here, get all your health back if you want, if you did some training before you left. Um, so yeah, if you need that, but, yeah, so, since we did all that, we can go ahead and head back out. And here, this was also off limits when we started. Where are you? What if my son's already left? When it's just me and my wife here? I have no idea how lonesome it gets. He used to give us nothing but heads when he was here, but now that he's gone, I kind of miss him. Strange, isn't it? And toilet. Um. Okay. <laughs> anyway. Oh, Johnny's got. What, what the fuck is wrong with him? Oh my god, I didn't mean to do that. That's really funny. Um, yeah. Anyway. You got this place, too. It's a, it's locked for the time being. You can also save again if you really feel like it. Um. So yeah, you can hit on the train. You could also go through here. This is the train graveyard. Um. You don't really need to go through here. Um, it's really just more of a, um, training spot than anything. So yeah, just attack. If you want to do some training here. Um, if you... Really, the best part about it really is just making money, honestly, so yeah. Um, yeah, but we're not gonna do that right now. 
So, we'll just head back out. Back out on the train. Yo! Send a private car, so split up! Who's <sighs> ups again? God, don't I just have all the luck? Be happy your ass has a job. You say something? I say, you say something. Now look at that, they got on all of a sudden. What's going on? Damn! It's because of... It's empty because of guys like you. Oh god. <laughs> You seen the news light? Avalanche says there'll be more bombings. Only devoted employees like me would go to Midgar a day like today. You work for Shinra? I won't give in to- Okay, Barrett. Fucking lucky ass nigga. I mean, pardon me. Um, so what are we gonna do now? The hell are you so calm? You busting up my rhythm. Oh my god, I love their dynamic. Looks like they just finished guys in the cars. We're finally leaving. So, what's our next target? Ha! <laughs> Listen to Mr. Serious about his work. Alright, I'll tell ya. Jesse's probably already told you, but there's a security checkpoint at the top plate. It's an ID scan system checking all the trains. Which Senra is very proud of. We can't use our fake IDs anymore. Good morning, and welcome to Midgar Lines. Our arrival at Section 4 Station is 11.45. That means we'll only... That means we've got only three more minutes to the ID checkpoint. Alright, in three minutes we're driven off this train. Got it! Cloud, come over here. Let's look at the railway map monitor. Talk to you. You're the only one that'll talk to me or come to my house. I'm impressed. Alright, talk to you. Hmm, looks like you've seen this already. It's alright, come a little closer. Oh shit. That's not good. That's odd. The ID checkpoint was supposed to be further down. Type A security alert. Unidentified passengers confirmed. A search of all cars will be conducted. Repeat. Type A security alert. Unidentified passengers confirmed. A search of all cars will be conducted. What's happening? What's going on? We're in trouble. I'll explain later. Hurry, get to the next car. Damn it, someone blew it. Unidentified passengers located in car one, preparing for lockdown. Let's go, keep it up. Car one, lockdown, upgrades level two warning. Hurry, they're locking the door, sir. Um, actually, if you talk to that guy, I did it too quick, but if you talk to that guy in the back, I was laying down, you can get a phoenix down, but... It's okay. Don't worry about it. Can I run? Thank you. Car 2 lockdown. Upgraded to warning level 3. Alright, we clear? Not yet. They're still hurting another check. If we're caught, we're done for. But don't worry, if we move up the train car by car, we should get past it. Moving to front of the train, currently tracking location. <laughs> yep, that dude just stole 200 bucks from you, but fuck it. Um, please move, thank you. There we go. Upgrade to maximum security alert! Get it. Alright, we made it. Yo, this way. Let's go, we're gonna dive out of here. Scary, huh? I mean, I already did this. Too late for that now, Why, why'd you come along anyway? Because... Hey, you two, this ain't the time for that! And... I've made up my mind. Watch closely, I'm gonna jump! You have so much to- oh, well, it's too late, too late for that, I guess. You don't care if I go first? A leader always stays till the end. Don't worry about me, just go! Yo, don't go kidding your spiky ass hurt. It's only the beginning of the mission. Oh my god, I love it. 
Later, you take care of the rest. Good, so far everything's going as planned. Don't let your guard down until we get to the Sector 5 reactor. Big was and just you got everything ready for us, so move it! The road is just down this tunnel. And... Yeah, if you didn't make it out and fast enough, basically you just start further down. So the lights, the light beams are shooting your security sensors. We can't go any further. Unless... That's one damn tiny hole. You telling me to squeeze into that to get under that plate? No way. Yo, Cloud, what are we gonna do? Let's look inside first, just to be safe. Doesn't seem like anything will get us stuck in this ducts. Okay, but if we go out of this duct, we won't be able to come back. Don't be wasting time, never know when Shinra will find us. Cloud, just gotta go. Alright, but damn man, that thing gives me the chills. Oh, item. Ether, yay. Stockpile on those. Um. Oh god, those perspectives are so weird. Um... Anyway... Gotta fight! Now, with that all material equips, you can hit- you can do this. Oh, she's asleep, that sucks. Um... And with that all material attached, you can take stuff out a lot quicker than normal. So... Yep, that's gonna come in handy. I don't know about XP. See what's up here. All right. And let's talk to Jesse here. I'm sorry, the ID scan problem on the train was all my fault. I modified your ID card and that's what did it. I did my best, but I failed. Oh, don't blame yourself. Now, let's take this potion here. Let's head out here. Let's see what's down here. Ooh, safe spot. That will come in handy. And oh my god. Oh, excuse me. Um That. Grab this tent and save. Now, I think that tent I can use it here 
it will restore every it will restore everybody's stats. But I'm not gonna use it yet. Save that shit. Um We're gonna pull out now. We'll meet up at the hideout. Cloud will count on you to blow up that reactor. Here. Now it looks just like the other one, so I guess that's to be expected. Alright, so. Ooh, break. And triple kill. Go. Grab an antidote. Let's go up here, see what's up here. Be something up here that may be worth my time. Switch on. And grab this. Ether. Yep, that was worth it. And oh, good. And that takes care of that. Level up, yay! Um, let's see, looks like it was just that ether. So, yep. Head back out. Switch on. And battles. Oh, come on, there we go. Yay, yeah, crit. Alright. Right. Deadly waste. What does that do? Use bio 2 on all opponents. I think that's poison magic. I'm already almost out of magic. That's kind of a bummer. Um. Yeah, it's the exact same setup as the other one. Yes. Anyway. Just head down here. There's even a safe spot. Look at that. Great. And with that safe spot, I think this is honestly a good time to use that tent. So. Save. Head out here. Dude, really? Oh, I wanna save my shit. Ow. Ow. Come on! Ugh. There we go. And here we are. Uh, oh. Is he okay? Papa! 
Wait, is she wearing a hat? Sephiroth? Did Sephiroth do this to you? Sephiroth, soldier, Mako reactor, Shinra. I hate them all! Oh. Damn, man, get a hold of yourself. You alright? Tifa. Hmm? No, forget it. Come on, let's hurry. I have a seizure. And. And. Now we're just gonna go back out the way we came. Might have been a little preemptive on that tent, but that's okay. Should be alright. This letter. Oops, okay, and now I'm gonna head back into that room with the ether. It's about to level up soon. Click. Jesse said we all had to push the button at once. I always hated this part. This part gets on my nerves so much. This always took me forever. There we go. That actually took- that actually did not take as long as I was expecting. And, alright. Safe spot! That's probably where I should have used that tent, actually. But whatever. Can't do anything about it now. And now we can now we've got to get ready for our next boss fight. This way. Uh, oh shit. Guards. What the hell's going on? A trap? Hello. President Shinra? Why is the president here? Hmm. So he almost be um what was it? Avalanche! And don't you forget it. So you're President Shinra, huh? Long time no see, sir. 
Oh, you. You're the one who quit Soldier and joined Avalanche. I knew you'd be. Then I knew you'd been exposed to Mako from the look in your eyes. Tell me, Trader, what was your name? Cloud. Forgive me for asking, but I can't be expected to remember everyone's name, unless you become another Sephiroth. Ah, uh, Sephiroth. He was brilliant. Perhaps too brilliant. Sephiroth. I don't give a damn about none of that. This place is going up with a big bang soon. Serves y'all right. And such a waste of good fireworks just to give it a vermin like you. That's all you can say? Soon we're all the vermin for killing the planet. Yes, that make you king vermin, so shut up, jackass. You're beginning to bore me. I'm a very busy man, so if you excuse me, I have a dinner I must attend. Dinner? Don't give me that, I ain't even start with you yet. But I've made arrangements for a playmate for you all. What's that noise? The hell is that? Uh, oh god. Airbuster, a techno soldier. Our weapon development department created him. I'm sure the data he'll extract from your device will be of great use to us in future experiments. Techno soldier? Oh shit, an airplane. Now then, if you'll excuse me. Wait, President. Oh, he's gone. Well, we gotta do something about this guy first. Help! This is from Soldier? No way, it's just a machine. I don't care what it is, we're just gonna bust him up! Alright, boss fight! Attack. So. Yep. Ow! I actually did kind of a lot. So, yep. This boss isn't too bad either. So, it's really basically no different from the first boss, except he's not weak to, he's not as weak to magic as the last one was. So yeah. As long as you got people, as long as you, as long as you heal in between turns and everything, you should be okay. Okay, I actually kind of got scared for a second. <laughs> um. Um. Okay. Oh, that was it. Okay, cool. I didn't even need to do anything. Perfect. You get an item, some money. That was fun. Yeah, that was very, yeah, that was very simple. But, oh, God. Uh oh. It's gonna blow. Let's go, Tifa. Here, can't you do something? I mean, it doesn't look like it. Not a damn thing. Cloud, please don't die. You can't die. There's still so much I want to tell you. I know, Tifa. Hey, you gonna be alright? You worry about yourselves. I'm alright, but take care of Tifa. Alright, sorry about all this. Stop talking like this is the end. Okay, hold on. And... <gasps> no! Cloud! I always love the way he falls. He just falls like he doesn't give a shit. He's just like... Like, just blank-faced. <laughs> oh my god, I love it. Oh, I love 1997 graphics. You alright? Can you hear me? Y yeah. Back then, I only got scraped knees. What do you mean by back then? What about now? Can you get up? What do you mean by back then? What about now? Don't worry about me. Worry about yourself now. I I'll try. Oh, it moved. How about that? Take it slow now, little by little. Hello? Hello? The fuck is that? What is going on? Hey, who are you? Hello? Oh. It's you again. Y 
you okay? This is the church in the Silk Five Slums. You just fell from above. You really gave me a scare. I, I came crashing down. The roof and the flower bed must have broken your fall. You're lucky. I know, right? Flower bed? Is this yours? Oh, damn. Um, sorry about that. That's alright. The flowers are here. The flowers here are quite resilient because it's a sacred place. They say grass and flowers won't grow in Midgar, but for some reason they have no trouble blooming here. I love it here. I mean, okay. Alright, and I guess with that, I think that's a good as time as any to call it an episode. So, next time I guess we'll see what's up with this chick, and I'll catch y'all later. See ya!